you want to know how to add the sizes on Big Cartel, you've come to the right place. So the steps are quite simple, but make sure to watch this video till the very end so you won't make any mistakes. So firstly, of course, we need to create our account and here we are on our profile workspace like dashboard orders and products are here. And in order to add sizes, let's say that we want to add the sizes for our t-shirt or something like this. We need to open our product page. So in the top of the screen on our workspace, just simply click on the product page. So if you are uh, new to this uh, platform, you need to create a new product. And all you need to do is just simply click on add product right up here and then just simply fill all the fields we have. So let's uh, follow these steps together. I'm going to click on plus and I just simply need to add some additional stuff. So let's um, uh, find some photos for our t-shirt and then we'll add some maybe sizes right up here. So let's use this stuff here. I'm going to uh, download this stuff. And if you want to add the sizes, there is like nothing hard. Uh, all you need to do is just simply use these uh, steps. So firstly, we need to add our we need to add our photo. Then just simply black T-shirt. Add some description. Um, also, we can mention all of the sizes we have inside of the description, so it will be easier for customers to find do they have like do we have necessary suitable size as for them so let it be like sizes um, extra small small uh, medium large and extra large for example why not so uh, after that in order to add it we just simply need to firstly add it to our category and then just simply add a status. Um, and I'd like to add a price. And let's say that we want to add like sizes itself. So people will be able to uh, find the necessary product and then they will be able to find uh, the necessary size. So uh, it will help us with variant. So in order to do it, we need to click on add variant and then just simply find uh, input the necessary name. So let it be like XS size, also like S size, then M size, large size, and extra large size. So now we have uh, five different variants, five different sizes, and in order to save all the uh, changes, you simply click on save in the bottom of the screen. So now here yeah, our product is basically ready, and if you'll we'll click on it, we can find that we have all the variants right up here. And how will it perform on our website? So if we'll open our account, and then just simply open our website, we can find the option that we have this product inside of our shop and if we'll click, we can easily find select variants. So we can find the uh, like description with information about sizes and we can uh, click on select variant and here we can choose like X as size. So now we can add it to cart for example and then just simply change it to L size, add it to cart and if we'll go to cart now, we can find some information and we can find that um, two of these t-shirts were added in a different sizes like XS, extra small and large size. So then we'll click on the checkout and we'll pay uh, here on our workspace. Uh, we'll be able to find all the information about our um, about our variant. So basically it means like about sizes. So if uh, orders were in S size, like small size, we'll be able to find information on our orders page. In order to manage that, for example, we can also add like uh, colors if it's necessary. We can click on the necessary t-shirt, add variant, for example, like um, yellow size, a yellow color, color, and also like red color. So then we can just simply click on save. And the same stuff, if we'll try to uh, open our shop, we can find this information right up here. So we can change it like to yellow color, add one with yellow, and also add one with a red color. 
and then we'll uh, like order it and then we'll be we'll purchase it we'll be able to find all the information right up here as for customer and also then we'll check out so we'll be able to find this information is inside of our orders and moreover if we we'll try to go to our dashboard we can find information about our sales We'll also be able to find uh, additional information like in what variants uh, they were bought. For example, uh, we can find uh, the most popular variant. For example, if a large size is the most popular, we'll find this information. So probably it will be helpful for our business. Uh, we can order more uh, t-shirts in a large size or in extra large because you know uh, extra small and small are not that popular as in our case so it, it could be helpful for every single product not for uh, cloths you can also use it for other uh, orders for example i don't know for some shoes uh, for some other drop shipping products you can sell if you have different variations so all we need to do is just simply add the necessary uh, variant. So as you can see, we can also enable inventory, uh, inventory, uh, like uh, inventory tracking. Uh, in order to do it, we need to find the necessary plan as for us. If you have like, uh, you don't want to use this uh, tracking, you can use a free plan. If you want, you can upgrade it to platinum or a diamond, like 50 products. Um, it's okay. I don't think that there are a lot of uh, products in uh, one single shop. You can create a lot of shops by the way. So if you'll upgrade it to Platinum, we'll be able to use Google Analytics, uh, integration code, advanced theme customization, inventory tracking and subscription beta. So of course, if you're starting, it's okay to use gold plan. But I think if you want to continue to use Big Cartel, Platinum plan is the best one as for us. So yeah, uh, I think that um, it's pretty easy to understand. And uh, if we are going to use this stuff, okay, it's, okay, of course it's more useful to add sizes, to add color variations for our t-shirt. But if you have, for example, size and color at the same stuff, it will be pretty hard for us to customize. For example, we'll have to add like large green, large yellow and large red. And there will be a lot of options we can choose. So it's better to sell products which only have like one category people can uh, change or customize inside of our shop. So yeah, this is definitely the way of how to add sizes on a big cartel. Hope this video helped you out. If it is, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel and leave your comment under this video. Goodbye.